So the Washington Commanders, they make a trade earlier in the day and they get Carson Wentz from the Indianapolis Colts. You know, pretty big deal here for a, a second and two third rounders. So the Colts here last season, they fell short in the playoffs and Carson Wentz, it was an up and down season for him and the Colts. But we know the Commanders, they needed a quarterback after they got Ryan Fitzpatrick last off season. He didn't do anything. He got hurt right away. Then obviously... They made a couple other guys got in the lineup over there, and it just didn't work out with Allen getting hurt as well at quarterback. And then obviously Colt McCoy, so right here, Carson Wentz now, third team in third seasons. Obviously he was on the Eagles the first few years of his career, then the Colts, and now to the Commanders. And last season with the Indianapolis Colts, 3,563 pass yards, 27 touchdowns, 7 interceptions. 215 rush yards, a rushing touchdown, a two-point conversion, and five fumble losses. So right here, his number one target will be Terry McLaurin, and he's the better receiver out of what he played with last season, even though we saw Michael Pittman Jr. step up for the Indianapolis Colts. But right now, he goes to a command the team with a good running back as well in Antonio Gibson. Obviously, he's no Jonathan Taylor, but he plays in an easier division as well. In the NFC East. So Carson Wentz back in the NFC East here with the Commanders. Third team in third years. And in terms of fantasy football goals, he's probably a guy you're going to draft in the later rounds of your league here. Because Washington quarterbacks over the last few seasons, they just haven't been good for fantasy football. And Carson Wentz throughout his career has been very injury prone. Even the last season, surprisingly, he only maybe missed one ball game if that's so a Carson Wentz traded once again early in the day. From Indianapolis to Washington. And we'll see if he could have another decent season like he did last season with his new team back in the NFC East.